Hey guys, how's it going? We have one topic. We will go over the current light curve of Tabby Star using Bruce Gary's current measurements and show that not only the brightening trend has stopped, but the flux seems to be dimming once again. So for a big picture reference, this is the 20 data point simple moving average flux curve of Tabby Star using David Lane's V-band measurements over more than a two year span of time. And since our last update, we received only one new flux measurement from David Lane on November 11th, which was not included in our previous update. So to give you a complete picture with the data we have, we will expand the portion of the light curve in the red box to show where we were on November 11th, and then we will update you to the present date using Bruce Gary's G-band measurements. So this shows the 20 data point simple moving average of David Lane's V-band data. And the low point was on September 14th of this year, and it rose approximately 1.13% to its highest average point on November 10th of this year. The data measurement on November 11th brought down the average, and we were hoping that this past week we would be able to confirm that Tabby Star was now beginning to dim once again. But the weather in Nova Scotia, Canada did not cooperate with us, so a little bit of a disappointment there. So we will use Bruce Gary's G-band measurements to fill in the missing gaps in the highlighted red box. So let's zoom in and replace this portion of the graph with Bruce Gary's G-band measurements. So this is the 20 data point simple moving average light curve of Bruce Gary's G-band measurements. And we have included the last five days of the measurements and their corresponding averages in the right bottom corner. So on November 17th, for the first time since the brightening event began, the 20 data point simple moving average fell from its preceding average point, and it has continued to fall for the past three days. So this channel believes that the flux of Tabby Star is most likely back in a dimming trend. And the next question is, what will be the slope of the dimming as it continues to round down? So guys, stay tuned and we will continue to track the surprises of this weird star. Take good care of yourselves and we will see you in our next video update.